Hey guys, so today's video is going to be my July BoxyCharm unboxing. I have been doing these videos every month and you guys seem to really like them and personally BoxyCharm is one of my favorite subscription boxes so I'm always excited to get this and technically today isn't an unboxing like me opening it for the first time because I have already opened it. If you do follow BoxyCharm on Instagram you would have seen that they did approach me and they asked me to make a tutorial for their YouTube channel. That's what I did and they sent me a bunch of the Tarina Tarantino conditioning lip sheens that are in this month's BoxyCharm. Everybody does get one in the box this month so they sent me a few of them so that I could do a tutorial on it. So I did already see what I got but, but, I haven't tried any of these products on my face. You guys know that at the end of my unboxing videos, I like to try on the products for the first time and tell you guys the first impressions. And I haven't done that with any of the products in this box except the lip sheen. So everything else will be a first impression, me applying it for the first time and all that good stuff. So let's jump right in. So this is what the box looks like on the inside this month. The theme of the box is called Beach Babe. And on the back of this card, it does list the products you got in the box and how much they're worth. So the first thing in the box is this Model Co Cheek and Lip Tint and this one is in the shade Rosy Red. I'm not exactly sure if everybody got the shade Rosy Red. So let me go ahead and open it. This is what it looks like, like the actual product. I actually haven't even swatched it or anything. It's actually a really cute little packaging and let's see how it swatches. Oh, that looks like jelly. You can't tell, but it looks like jelly. So it does blend out really nicely. Kind of just disappears, but like in a good way because I'm a little bit afraid of um, cheek, lip, and tints. You guys probably know that. They're not, I don't really use them all that much, but this one does blend. I'm not trying to flip you off, but this one does have a nice tint and it blends really, really nicely. And, oh, I got some on my nose. Very, very fruity. It smells really good. This is a full-size product as per usual, and this retails for $22. So this alone is worth more than the box. Next up is this Ofra eyeliner. I don't know if I'm saying that brand right. Ofra. And it is just a black eyeliner. I know that in everyone's box, you either got an eyeliner or a lip liner, and everybody got different colors. So in this box that I have, it is a black eyeliner. And it's pretty black. I mean, it, like, that is an intense black color. Personally, I don't think you can have too many black eyeliners. That's just me. I use black eyeliner all the time. And this is full size and retails for $13. The next thing in the box I was really, really excited about when I saw that this was in this month's box. Because if you do watch my videos, you know that recently I had ordered some Morphe brushes and I was absolutely in love with them. They're really inexpensive, amazing. And in the box this month, they sent out a Morphe face brush, which is insane. I think there are three different brushes you could have gotten. And the one that I got in my box is the S19. It's really, really soft. Morphe brushes are such high quality for such a like affordable price. I love them, so I will definitely be using this. It's a great brush, I could already tell, because, you know. And this, of course, is a full size. It's a brush, and this retails for $19.99 which is pretty expensive for a Morphe brush because their eye brushes are like under six bucks. So, but I mean, they're really good quality, so I would pay $20 for this, my, I would. The next thing in the box is this Enter Pronoun by makeup artist Natalia Ramirez Blowtorch Bronzer, which is a strange name, a Blowtorch Bronzer. I've actually never heard of this brand or have heard of this bronzer at all, but the packaging is unreal. Look at this packaging. It has like that chrome and it looks like a mirror. It says enter pronoun, like I've said, never heard of this. And this is what the bronzer looks like. It is such a beautiful packaging though. Like look at that, look at that, look at that, look at that. And the mirror is phenomenal. So this is what the bronzer looks like. Let me swatch it, it's the first time I swatch it. It is a warm bronzer. It does have orange undertones, which, oh my God, this is very smooth though. This is such a smooth bronzer. You could definitely tell that this bronzer is high quality. And even though it does have those orangey undertones, it kind of has like a brick orange red undertone, which I actually really, really like. 
to use as an actual bronzer. I wouldn't necessarily contour with this, even though you absolutely could because it is a matte finish. It, it, there's no shimmer in this. But I love colors like this to just dust on the cheek and around my forehead and stuff, especially in the summertime, to just give my face a nice warm glow. I know a lot of people are fans of warm bronzers. Um, so yeah, I definitely see myself using this. I will try it on at the end of this video, of course, to see how I like it, but so far, it's very smooth, and I'm, I'm not opposed to the color at all. This is a full-size product, and this retails for $35. You already know what I'm going to say. That's expensive. So I'm really happy that I got this. I think there was another bronzer they were giving out. You either got this one or another brand bronzer, I think. So yeah. And then the last thing in the box is one of the Tarita Tarantino Conditioning Lip Sheens. Guys, when I tell you that these things are amazing, I am not kidding. I hadn't heard of Tarita Tarantino until I was introduced to BoxyCharm. But from what I hear, it's a very like luxurious brand. It's a high-end brand and a lot of people love it. And this is what the packaging looks like. Look at this lip sheen. It has that chrome finish and it has like little diamonds all around this lipstick it's beautiful and um, and I did get a bunch to try out but this one is one of my favorite ones so I just want to show you this one is in the shade pink elephant this is the most beautiful moisturizing lipstick or lip sheen like in the world it feels so so comfortable on my lips and it just looks really really good on I just I was so impressed I really love this and this is full size and this retails for $22. So if you want to see some of these products in action, then just keep on watching. So I took off my lipstick to show you this fantastic little product. I have tried this already before, but I just want to show you like a swatch on my lips. This is in Pink Elephant. And I absolutely love it. So, so moisturizing. I love it. Even if you don't get BoxyCharm, I definitely recommend these Tarina Tarantino Conditioning Lip Sheens. I'm going to try out the Cheek and Lip Tint. <laughs> Wish me luck. I hate these things. I don't hate them. They're just... I don't like... I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so I'm just going to dab this on my cheeks. Kind of crazy style. It's actually blending on pretty well. Like I said in the beginning, I could tell that this one was easily blendable. So I mean I like it, it's a pretty color. This one, this cheek looks a little funky. Keep in mind that it is a stain, so once it sets, it's gonna set. That is the only reason why some of these things are not my favorite. But this one blends out really nicely. Let me try it on my lips. This smells so incredible. So this is it on my lips, and I do prefer it on my lips, actually. Um, these kind of lip stains are amazing to wear underneath red lipstick, so that if your red lipstick fades throughout the day, then you still have, like, a stain. I'm going to try out the eyeliner to see how smooth it is. Okay, so it does have really, really good pigmentation. I'm impressed with the pigmentation. It was a little sharp. I kind of stabbed my eye there at first a little bit, so I had to, like, dot it like this to kind of flatten it out a little bit because it was just way too sharp but the pigment is really nice now will it last all day that I don't know okay now what I'm excited for the enter pronoun which is a weird brand name I think bronzer I'm gonna use the morphe brush I think it only makes sense just gonna dab it in and then tap the rest just applies. I already have a lot of products on my cheek, but let's just see how this looks. I really, really like this. I feel like this is throwing me off because this was underneath this. So that's throwing me off a bit, but I really like the warmth of the color. Even though you think of an orange bronzer and it's a little bit scary, but I do like the warmth it gives my face. Okay guys, so that was everything I got in this month's BoxyCharm. The overall value of this box this month was $112. So you pay $21 for this box 
and you get $112 worth of stuff. Insane. Can't believe it.